Hi friends, welcome back to Shal SciTechker. In this video, I'm going to uh, show you what will be the end benchmark score in the Redmi Note 11 Pro and Redmi Note 11 Pro Plus. So this is a question which I'm getting from plenty of my subscribers ask me to make a video. The main reason is because the Redmi Note 11 Pro and Redmi Note 11 Pro Plus, they do come with the Dimensity 920 processor. So that's the reason few of the users are really interested to know what will be the benchmark score for the Dimensity 920 processor. And a quick uh, disclaimer that in this video, what I'm the Android benchmark scores, which I'm trying to demonstrate, those I did gather from the online videos only friends, which are reviewed by other YouTubers, because right now I don't have the device, unfortunately. So that's how I'll be able to get to know what will be the Android benchmark score in those uh, phone. So as per the company claims, the Redmi Note 11 Pro and the Pro Plus will be having the 5 lakhs of Android benchmark test in this MediaTek Dimensity 920 processor. As you can clearly see, it's 5 lakhs because 900 processor also, I think it gets around close to 4 lakhs, 50,000 and 4 lakhs, 60,000 in the Oppo Reno 6 and other phones with the Dimensity 900 chipset. So 920 can be slightly upgradable. That's what a lot of people thought. But unfortunately, the Redmi Note 11 Pro and Pro Plus, they got very less benchmark score when compared with the 900. That's what I, I got really shocked after watching a couple of videos online. So now let me just show you a couple of uh, screenshots. So this is an benchmark score which I did get from the Frankie Tech as well. So there you can actually see Note, Redmi Note 11 Pro Plus which says 4 lakhs 24,000. So that's very low score. Not only in this one video, I did watch other videos. I did watch from other video like uh, Technic video as well. So there you can actually see 4 lakhs 32,000 in other phone as you can see friends exactly so very low score when compared with the file likes whatever the company is climbing exactly so you can clearly see what is happening so this is at, at the beginning stage only friends so maybe if you try to use a performance mode in the settings option that might give the slight boosting up options as well so here's another benchmark score which has got about four lakhs twenty seven thousand so this is another benchmark score which I did gather from the Sahil Buy. So these are the few benchmarks which are just displaying you regarding the Redmi Note 11 Pro and Pro Plus. So maybe those benchmarks were done in the balanced mode, I guess. So maybe if you try to use the performance mode, then the benchmarks may be slightly better. But it does did not make any kind of uh, difference in my previous phones which I used Mi 11X device. So maybe I'm not sure what is happening at this moment. So unless we get the unit, we are not sure what's going on with the Dimension 920 chip chipset. But overall friends, that feels quite low. What are the companies claiming exactly 5 lakhs benchmark? We are nowhere around close to that 5 lakhs. So the highest we've seen is around close to 4 lakhs 32,000 only. So 4 lakhs 32,000, 4 lakhs 27,000 and 4 lakhs 24,000. So these are the kind of scores we are getting on the Dimension 920 processor at this moment. And in case if you have any other questions, let me know in the comment section below friends. Definitely. Are you interested in the Redmi Note 11 series or not? So please let me know in the comments. Maybe I can plan in the future to buy any kind of phones if possible. Redmi Note 11 series as well. And that's it friends. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Unless you more updates. Meanwhile, signing off and bye.